Since December 14, 2022, our system ranks Boyle as a cell candidate, giving it a score of minus 4.926. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 79.40%. This is an average return of minus 2.56% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Boyle our last headline reads, Boyle ETF price took a fall of minus 14.05% on Monday. The Boyle ETF price fell by minus 14.05% on the last day, Monday, January 30, 2023, from $8.47 to $7.28. During the last trading day the ETF fluctuated 8.55% from a day low at $7.25 to a day high of $7.87. The price has fallen in 7 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 32.22% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day by 2 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 47 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $339.17 million. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the ETF was $140.50, and the lowest price was $7.25. Right now the price is 94.82%, or $133.22, below 52-week high and 99.01%, or $729.52, below all-time high November 14, 2018 where the price hit $736.80. The ETF lies in the middle of a very wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 64.54% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 98.07% and 14.89%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 27.06% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 100% and 963.2%. This equals a price between $0.77.40 and $0.47 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets The following signals have been found for Boyle. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Boyle ETF holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $8.88 and $18.85. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, December 13, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 82.24%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the ETF should be followed more closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 32 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 264 days ago. Short term moving average, by signal 7 days ago. Long term moving average, by signal 33 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 38 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 29 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 96 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 94 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Boyle there is no support from accumulated volume below today's level and given the right condition the ETF may perform very badly in the next couple of days. This ETF may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this ETF is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, 
the ETF moved $0.620 between high and low, or 8.55%. For the last week, the ETF has had daily average volatility of 10.7%. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Boyle meets first resistance at $8.12. If you do not hold Boyle shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. The stock does not have any support from accumulate volume below and may therefore fall very hard and fast given the right conditions. Caution is warned and you should not place any bet unless you're a skilled trader and know how to play these cases. We hold a negative evaluation for this ETF, no stop loss set. Is Boyle ETF a buy? Boyle holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this ETF. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Tuesday 31st we expect Boyle to open up $0.187 and start trading at $7.47. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the ETF? Remember